Hi guys, uh, I'm Billy, and uh, my dad's in the middle of a midlife crisis at the moment. Um, so midlife crisis, you, it's like old people look back at all their achievements, or lack of achievements, um, and they get old and they feel like they haven't done much with their life, so they just kind of like pretend they're young to avoid the fact they're running out of time. So um, <laughs> my dad's doing that at the moment, and he's decided to start with a name change. And you think like, oh, what's he going to change his name to? Something like young, hip, cool, Ethan, Mike, Justin. Uh, no. My dad's changing his name to Smokey. <laughs> Smokey, Dad. Couldn't think of anything younger sounding than Smokey. Um, yeah, and he insists on it too. We were at Boost the other day, right? And she's, the lady's taking our order. Oh, what's your name? I'm Billy. What's your dad's name? That's Tim. <coughs> <coughs> Smokey. <coughs> that's, that's Smokey. You can put that on the cup. Um, and so... <laughs> My dad's also a self-proclaimed white boy pizza legend. Self-proclaimed, because no one else is describing him like that. And I was making pizza the other day. And I'm over here making the pizza. Hey, Dad, can you help me with the pizza? What's the magic word? Smoky. Can you help me with the pizza? And so, with this pizza legend status and the new name, he thinks he's like top stuff. Like, he's on it. He talks to normal people the way Gordon Ramsay talks to kitchen staff. <laughs> I'm sorry, does, um, does this pizza have organic parmesan on it? Like, Dad, shut up, we're at Domino's. Jeez. And so, you know, with this new, he's pizza king. Obviously, he's got to change his music taste to suit. So now he listens to, like, just Italian music centering around a general love for pizza. Um, we know the song Amore, kind of. Yeah, yeah. I get home from school and he's sitting here, right, and he's, uh, he's making his pizza and he's singing the song and he's got it on the radio, right, but right up loud and he's singing so loud and he looks like an opera singer and he's got so much emotion in his eyes and I think, wow, Dad, never looked at me with that much emotion in your eyes. It's always just, Billy, hang the washing. Billy, set the table. Billy, where's the cat covered in bread? You know, usual. So now that my dad, you know, new start, right, he's got an entrepreneurial business. He is an entrepreneur, right? Uh, his business is called One Last Ride. It's a funeral transportation business. Uh, and so because they're, you know, a startup business, they've had a lot of trouble getting funding. So they can't actually afford a coffin or separate transport for the living and dead. So this is the back seat and here's you. Here's your sister. Here is Great Aunt Nelly, and she is as dead as Britney Spears' career, but like clipped in, propped up, living her best life. A bit gross. Uh, my dad also, he's um, gotten into speeding recently. A bit weird to say someone's gotten into speeding, but he has, he really enjoys it. Um, and so, you know when you like speed up really fast and everything like goes backwards? So same, like that happens to him, and you think, oh, that's fine, like dead body hits the back seat, no. Uh, this baby torpedoed out the back window of the car onto the car behind. The look of like shock, horror, and a little bit of disgust in that woman's eyes. I think he launched bloody Clive Palmer at her. Jeez. Anyway, uh, thanks guys. I've been Billy, and you've been mediocre. <laughs> Billy Hoban, ladies and gentlemen.